everyone. The sounds you're hearing in the background uh, are at Fun Spot America Atlanta. That's the sound of Airy Force One. And I am so fortunate to be here right now. There you can hear it. It's going out that 155 foot lift hill. I am here right now with the CEO and owner of Fun Spot America. This is John Airy Jr. John, it's you. It's you. It's the grand opening of this amazing Rocky Mountain Construction Coaster. How Thank excited you. are you? Oh, man, this has been two years in the making. So this is really, um, I can't believe it. I, I'm getting the goosebumps. The reviews are just making me so happy. Honestly, when you hear all these people cheering as they come by, and they're, they're just having a blast. It makes those last two years worth every single day, every single penny we've put into this. Um, I'm just, I'm beyond myself. And uh, I, I don't know how to put it into words. I just, I'm so thankful and grateful that we have these, you all coming out and, and enjoying it and spreading the news for us and all of our fans, our family, our friends. I mean, it, literally, it was an incredible morning. The grand opening went flawless. I'm so happy. It and was amazing. There was a real astronaut here. Kirk yeah. Hurley. There was some pirate yeah, Doug, things. Yeah. We had an exciting event with a bunch of first riders who yeah. had donated to the National Roller Coaster That's Museum. That's right. Such a great event today. Yeah, so we raised $5,000 for the Roller Coaster Museum. Um, we Doug Hurley, amazing. Um, yeah, he's a legend, you know. And um, so we... Uh, we, we couldn't have asked for anything better. The weather's great. The, the the guests that we have in the park are just enjoying it, smiling, and thankful for it. We are coaster enthusiasts, so of course we want to hear about working with Rocky Mountain Construction. We're RMC fans. Yeah. Can you tell us about working with them? Who's, who's not an RMC fan, I mean, right? I mean, if you live in America, you got to be an RMC fan. Um, so what I love about RMC is their quality. They do what they say they're going to do. They over-deliver. They're, they're, uh, they... they in my opinion, they produce probably the best coaster in the world. And um, right here, it's just right in front of us. You, it, it's proof, it's evidence, right? And uh, this is just the beginning. There's more to come. And, and RMC is, is uh, definitely on the top of my radar. We've already started some conversations. Really? And, oh, um, that's exciting. I just, I, I just feel like when they produce this, it, they over, over delivered what I expected, right? So you have an expectation level and they just hit it up here. Um, I, so they, they did everything I wanted. It's a custom coaster that was delivered to what I wanted to reflect as my father and flight and zero G's and air times and all that stuff that he does as a pilot. And um, it's here and it's amazing. And it's named after y'all. It's named after <laughs> us. So um, that, feel like? that it's truly cool. I mean, yeah. how many people can say that they have their name on a roller coaster, right? Um, and, uh, and, and I'm thankful and, and I appreciate everybody that represents this industry and, and uh, can enjoy that and respect it. I got criticized a lot that we put our name in there and I, really? it really, it sort of hurt my feelings a bit, but um, a friend of mine that lives in Idaho, I'm not gonna tell you his name, says, John, there's gonna be people <laughs> out there in this world that just hate everything you do and they're gonna be jealous of you. He goes, but be proud. And from that day forward, I was like, I need to be proud. This is what it's all about, you know? And I honored my dad today, which means a lot to me. and. I'm thankful and, and for everything he's done for us as far as laying the foundation and just helping us be who we are today. We've got a great family company here. You we can do. tell the way that you all talk about each other, even in your speeches, giving love to your wives out there. Yeah. For anybody who's never been to Fun Spot America Atlanta, what, what advice would you give them? What do you want to let them know? Hey, come let, come on out right here in Fayetteville, Georgia. Uh, it's just 20 minutes south of the airport. It's to. easy to get to. Um, the road here, you can see the you can't. Well, if you just get on 85 and drive, you're going to run into it. You're not going to miss this coaster. So um, come on out. It's a fun park. I think we're up to about 25 rides now. We put about 20 million into it. Most of it is this coaster, but we do have a lot of other rides we've added, like the Screaming Eagles, the Tilt, the Riptide, the um, bumper cars, and new games, and new Midway, and new food. Two weeks ago, we just opened up an Annie Ann's stand. So we have Annie Ann's here. We, you know, Our food and beverage is getting better and better. Um, we've got a very good senior vice president of food and beverage that just recently joined us in the last year. And he's got great ideas, great plans. And um, come on out, just enjoy it. Get, you know, 
set your expectations low and let us exceed them. Uh, it's really a great part, and it's only going to get better. Well, I have had to, this is my first time here. I've had an absolute blast coming here Thank today. You. This poster is incredible. I have written it twice, once in the front, once in the back. i got to get on it even more. I go, go for it. Back row. Go for it. Let's finish sure. this so y'all can ride more. But, you know, some of the some of the things that I heard are, you know, unbelievable. That's amazing. That is a that is so much fun. It never slows yeah, down. It, the air, time. yeah, the air times, the everything about. I've heard so many different words to describe this coaster, and it's just it warms me. It gives me it gives me the goosebumps. Yeah. But what I love most is sitting in that break run and watching everybody come in, just laughing and smiling, talking to their friends, their family, whatever it may be, and they got tears coming out of their eyes because it's so fun. They're smiling. They're drooling. They're just. It's just. We, we did it. It's, we did definitely it. definitely did it. This is a home yeah. run. Everybody put your hands up in the air as you ride this poaster. Yeah. Feel like you're flying. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you all for being here today. And, and uh, thank you for your support. Thank you. Yeah. Can I have Nailed it. Oh, question? yeah. Sure. Yeah. yeah go for it. Uh, for the placement of it, was it like an easy, like, oh, yeah, we need to put it by the street or to the street? I knew I wanted it right next to the street as close as I could. And a little fact that not I don't know anybody knows this. But they have a setback off that road. I can't go another foot closer to the road. Really? I wanted it as close as I can get. The county had a hard time. They didn't really like it too much, but we, they, they did allow us to do it. And um, so I wanted it street side so everybody driving by. This is a pretty busy highway. Everybody yeah. driving by sees it and knows what we are here in town. So there was a purpose to it, and uh, we nailed it. I mean, you can't. Can you drive by without seeing it? You cannot. Yeah. Eye-catching. And, there, and people driving by for the first time, you know it's their first time because they slow down and everybody behind them slows down. And then I've seen traffic get pretty slow around here because they're just staring at the coaster. People are hanging out the windows, taking pictures of it as they drive by. It's uh, it's amazing. It's a great, and, and when you, to, to mention that, I love it because the white structure with the blue and red rails, amazing. Perfect. Amazing. I heard people saying, oh, it looks like Too Faced, this and that. What? It, it came together. You know what? It's Americana. It's what we're all about. And it looks so sharp. There's a reason I did that, too. And uh, that's so as you're walking down to Midway, you can see the, the double up coming, one color. And then as you come back the other way, it's a different color. So you can see that there's two yeah. different tracks. And, and I wanted both of those colors to pop. So that was strategically done that way. Fascinating. Yeah. I don't think I can think about that. Um, and so you have Kissimmee and Orlando and Atlanta. Do you see other cities in the future? Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm pretty tired from this project. It took a lot longer and uh, a little bit harder. We're, we're over budget because the county required us to do a lot of things uh, to the property. And some of it's right here, as you can see. Um, but there, are, there, other cities are not out of the equation. Yeah, we've um, during this project we had quite i would probably say a half a dozen opportunities that i just had to say i can't do it i'm i'm, I'm a bit tired and, and over exhausted uh, over overextended at this point um that we're all about opportunities and so when opportunities arise there may be a possibility yeah we love we love our brand we love our team we want to continue to grow it um future parks very well could be you never know uh, i know i know in my head there's two cities i want to be in in america before i retire uh-oh yeah everybody can guess what those are on social media <laughs> yeah <laughs> hope it's their hometown yeah, yeah. Hopefully it's LA. And, <laughs> and hopefully we can bring an rmc to those towns too yeah. something similar right well now yeah. they're gonna expect it yeah <laughs> congratulations on 25 years and thank you thank you for that